Hey guys, my name is Haley. Welcome back to the Disney Cupcake channel. Today it is time for another Disney room tour, so let's get started. So as you guys know, I do these room tour videos every six months, and it is finally time again for another one. I have all of my holiday decorations out, and I'm super excited to show them to you guys, so let's get started. So starting on the outside of my door, I have this please stand clear of the door sign and I put a little wreath on and I also have this little door hanger that I got in one of my fan mail packages and on the other side I have this little Mickey head Christmas ball and I just put some fun color confetti in there I also have my hamburger pass holder bag and some jewelry hanging moving over to this side I have this little jewelry type organizer and I just have a bunch of keychains hanging and some little signs and heading over towards my makeup table I have these really cool flags hanging around my mirror along with some Tsum Tsum holiday plush and I have this pin picture that has been up for a while and I am currently on the hunt for a picture to put right here but other than that I have all of my makeup stuff here and I still have some Mickey 90 stuff I need to take down and this is just a little drawer of makeup stuff with a little chair, some other little holiday items kind of sitting around, my video schedule, and some more fun keychains and things. Heading over then to my desk, I have this little stationery organizer. I have my fun spinny chair with my Disney cupcake pillow. And then I have my two advent calendars sitting on my desk. I'm doing the Disney sock one. And I'm also doing this Ulta makeup one. So I'm just rotating every other day doing all of the different ones. I've gotten a lot of fun socks from this. So I'm very, very excited about those. It's been fun to do that this month. I also have my Mickey head stapler and tape dispenser. And then these are just kind of a mix of holiday decorations and the figures I normally have out. And looking over where my desktop is, where I edit, I have all of these fun holiday stickers along with a bunch of other stickers from events, from fans, and some other little things that I've created. I have all of these other fun little holiday decorations out. And then all of these doodles I do plan on making merchandise for at some point with these ones that I've created here. So make sure you guys keep an eye out for that. I'll probably do another video once I release like a huge amount of new designs. I'm currently working on that. So the beginning of the new year-ish time I will have those designs up. So make sure you guys keep an eye out for that. I also have all of these keychains hanging. These ones are kind of wintry themed, but I couldn't really find any winter keychains because I used a lot of them on my tree, which is what we will get to in a minute. But here's just some more holiday figures and little decorations. And then I have my mystery minis, and I also put some cool snow globes up there that I have collected for a few years but haven't collected recently. So they're from a while ago, but they're still fun to display. And then I put all of my Frozen characters in the front for the Mystery Minis because those are the wintry characters that I have. So we just have some other snow globes over here. And then moving up, I have some more wintry kind of themed characters along with some Frozen Vinylmations up top. You can see Olaf. And then all of my pops are the same. I'm going to be doing a pop figure collection video. But on top of my display case, I have my Mickey Mouse Holiday popcorn bucket and some ear hats along with a bunch of holiday decorations inside. Mainly the more fragile ones. I really had a lot of fun setting up all of this stuff. And then we have my retro shelf, of course. I might be doing a retro Disney collection video, kind of all of the old Disney merchandise that I have at some point. And then down here are just some other snow globes. So moving away from my desk, I have my Christmas tree, and I love it so, so much. This year I added some colored lights inside of it, 
and I love the look of it. I did put a lot of keychains in here from different fan mails that I received and I have a lot of just my normal Disney ornaments in here. They're not all on this tree, they're on some other trees in my house. So maybe one day I'll do an ornament collection. My plan was to do that this year, but I ended up not doing it because I kind of ran out of time. So maybe next year I'll do one of those videos. And then I also have my whole pin board, which is pretty much full at this point and covered up. I'm probably going to be doing a pin collection video in January once my tree is out of the way. A new one that I did want to show you guys was I ordered this Walt Disney Imagineering Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway one. So that's an exciting one that I just got. But I'll definitely be working on adding a pin board. So maybe I'll do a whole pin video kind of showing what's going on here. I also have all of my holiday little buttons. I have some stockings hanging all around my mirror for my closet door. And then on this other little dresser stand, I made up my own little advent calendar. I've had this little Disney one for a while, but I wasn't really sure what I was going to actually put in it. So I have all of these little holiday candies, little presents and things that I put in all the different days at random. So every day I kind of take it out and add it to my little display. I have some other little decorations. I also decorated my whole Lego castle with these little lights and wreaths along with some little candies. My other little Duffy is dressed as a little elf and he's kind of helping out with the candy. I found this cool retro tin and I love it so much. That's such a great movie. I'm excited to watch that again. And then below my TV I have this train with all the Disney characters inside. And I have my H with all of my park attraction pins and park icon pins. I love those so, so much. And then looking over at my bed, I have lots of plush on it just because all of my holiday plush I'm displaying right now. I also have this really fuzzy Mickey Mouse holiday blanket. Over here in this other little display, I have some Tsum Tsum figures. All of my holiday ones that I received last year in the holiday advent calendar are displayed inside. All my holiday plush, they're mainly all Mickey and Minnie. There is a little stitch right there. I have some keychains from Tokyo Disney hanging on both ends of my curtain rod just because that's a good way to display them. Then behind my bed I have this little Cinderella castle light up along with all these little present boxes and my little Disney band with some park maps and little itty bitties. And I also have some of my other holiday finalmations up here right below my castle painting. And lastly on this other section of my bed I have all of my Tsum Tsum plush and micro plush that I have got from the advent calendars from last year and the year before. So those are all displayed and I have this little holiday R2D2 one as well. So that might actually be the quickest room tour I've ever done and I narrated it all. I normally don't do that. I normally just kind of film sections of my room and just like yo this is this and that's it. So I, I like the way that my room turned out for the holidays. I love having everything all decorated. I love it so so much. So thank you guys so much for watching this room tour video. Remember to stay tuned because in January I'm going to continue some of my other collection videos into January as well because there are a few other collections that I would like to share with you guys. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Remember to do what you love and do what makes you happy and I will see you guys next time. Bye!